Good morning, distinguished colleagues, honorable members of the Presidium, valuable friends. My name is Carlos Amador, and I am professor of chemistry at UNAM, nearby this beautiful place. I am thankful, honored, and proud to have served as a scientist academician in this uh, saga, the Accelerated Materials Discovery Challenge. As a scientist, I have, I have had to keep pace with the big leaguers you have heard about a few minutes ago. Not very effectively, I have to say, although a recent finding may send me to AAA league, maybe not the big leaguers, but AAA pretty soon. As an academician, I have been the spokesperson of the challenge to the academic community here in Mexico, mostly directors, chairs, and general authorities. As I said, I am very proud of what we have accomplished with the presentation of this report. You see, in the big leagues, we could find the world leader of robotic organic synthesis, and via Alain's and Christine's magic, make him jump on the challenge bandwagon. And same thing with the other authors of this report. But in Mexico, we don't necessarily have already a world-leading scientist in machine learning for materials discovery. Now we have to convince our finest scientists, which are very good in what they do, to apply their abilities to make advance this saga. We have already started with young, ambitions, brilliant guys like Diego Solis and Carolina Suriak. But in order to really become a powerhouse for materials discovery, we have to convince many more leading scientists to jump on the challenge bandwagon. We all know that the most effective way of doing so is through huge investments of money. We have heard already that Mexico is willing to do so, but to keep pace with the big leaguers, we also have to do it fast. And for that, we need the help and committed participation of many of the actors of the academic community, directors, chairs, and general authorities at universities, institutes, CONACYT, other public offices, secretariats. I am confident we will get them on this challenge. Thank you very much.